The Sea Shepherd has announced a new mission targeting other illegal fishing operations in the Southern Ocean, but the anti-whaling group says it's continuing to closely monitor activities of the Japanese government. Mark Reddy is in Hobart. The Bob Barker has arrived here in Hobart to refuel for a new patrol mission in the Southern Ocean. Operation Icefish will target six illegal boats accused of poaching Patagonian and Arctic toothfish. The hunting takes place in some of the most remote areas of the Antarctic. The meat, often branded as Chilean sea bass, is then distributed to unregulated ports in places like Indonesia. Activists say the sole traders are often seen flying flags of deterrence from countries such as North Korea. We will confront, obstruct and interfere with their illegal fishing operations. We will do a citizen's arrest of these ships, ordering them to port, demanding that authorities take over the arrest from us. And once again, we will be measure, measuring our success by how much wildlife we're able to save and protect down in the Southern Ocean. Now, these operators aren't connected to the Japanese whaling fleet. The Japanese government suspended its so-called scientific whaling program following this year's International Court of Justice ruling. But Tokyo has recently said it will resume activity in the Southern Ocean a year from now. Its whaling fleets continue to undertake non-lethal site sampling and Sea Shepherd activists say they'll be ready to take action if those fleets are found to be hunting whales. The Bob Barker departs here from Hobart on December 1st.